First the Wuhan virus, then the swine flu scare, then the bubonic plague in Inner Mongolia. China is deepening the global health crisis by failing to contain one outbreak after another. Do you know why? Because its priorities lie elsewhere. Beijing is busy profiteering from the pandemic, flexing its muscle in Ladakh, targeting other countries. The latest on the hit list seems to be Kazakhstan. China claims Kazakhstan is experiencing an outbreak of what it calls an unknown pneumonia. It says that this unknown pneumonia is deadlier than the Wuhan virus. Let me tell you quickly what's transpired in the last two days. The Chinese embassy in Kazakhstan issued a warning on the 9th of July, that's yesterday. Chinese citizens in Kazakhstan were informed that an unknown pneumonia had killed more than 1,700 people. The embassy said that the cases of unidentified pneumonia are on the rise. China, surprisingly, was also armed with data this time. It said that the unknown pneumonia had killed more than 1,700 people with more than 620 deaths taking place in the month of June alone. The Chinese embassy said that the disease was spreading in the regions of Atairu, Aktobe and Shimkent. All of this while maintaining that it's quote-unquote much deadlier than COVID-19. Well, how much of this is true? How do we know that this is not another diversionary tactic by Beijing? Kazakhstan says this is fake news, that China is spreading lies. Kazakhstan did, however, acknowledge the presence of viral pneumonias, as they put it, their words, viral pneumonias of unspecified etymology. But it says that this outbreak is neither new nor unknown and that WHO guidelines were followed. Kazakhstan has not released any data, but media reports claim that pneumonia cases in the capital, Nur Sultan, have more than doubled in June, with more than 200 people being admitted to hospitals every day. So what are we to make of this? Is this a new virus? Or is this related to COVID-19? And is China trying to wash its hands off another potential outbreak, one that Beijing itself claims is deadlier than the Wuhan virus? This is something that the World Health Organization will have to address. And let's hope that the WHO does its job for a change. As for China, it's better off concentrating on the numerous problems crying for attention at home. Perhaps it can start by releasing verifiable data on the origin of the Wuhan virus.